Hey everybody, this is Mon Retro Gamer, and welcome back to Let's Play Fantasy Star 4. In the last episode, we finished the Silver Soldier side quest, uh, which was a small callback to actually Fantasy Star 2, in the fact that uh, the computer that we killed was a uh, prototype version of Matavia's equivalent of Parma's uh, mother brain. Huh? Are you guys here to inspect the ruins? Well, uh, yes, we are. But who on earth are you? Forgive me for not introducing myself earlier. My name is Seth. I'm a traveling archaeologist. I came here in search of the ruins of an ancient temple, but there are monsters in the cave that leads to it. Hmm, that temple. Just where we're going. Ah, I knew it. How fortunate. If that's where you're headed, would you allow me to come with you? I do have confidence in my skills, and I don't intend to be a nuisance. Hmm, an archaeologist. Well, Han was a scientist. If there are monsters, the more of us there are, the more advantageous it'll be in a fight against them. Okay, I guess it's alright. Thank you very much. I appreciate your kindness. Rune? He's quite a polite person. Huh? Oh, uh, yes. And what's he got on him? This Seth character who is weaker than all of us. He's got a Laconian circlet, Laconian dagger, a flex shield, and a cyber suit. Can anybody else in the party equip that? Yes, they can. <laughs> and is it stronger? It's not stronger than Laconian male. So I uh, really don't see the point in uh, keeping it. Uh, what skill? What's what's he strong? How strong is he? Shadow, corrosion, mind blast, death, death spell. Uh, right, 135, 144. Yay! Somebody to put before Rune in the getting his order. This is gonna save us a lot. Uh, so we are going to head into the island cave and walk around Junior Ooze. And I just realized we have the, um, what's it called? Photon Eraser. Uh, Shriekers! It's a bunch of Shriekers. Oh no, oh no. Just kill him, Seth. Seth! Strange light, attack. Badunk. Badunk. Even Rune does two thirds of what Seth can do. Because Seth only has the Laconian dagger. Now, if a single dagger could do 90 something damage at the start, like back when, you know, we had Han who would, like, dual wield these things, that would have been cool. But we don't. Uh, Shrieker, 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 Shrieker. Just attack. We don't even need, like, Ren's multi hit. We just get a bunch of cure paralysis. Psh, not the best kind of item. Junior Ooze, Ju Junior Ooze. Ooze. Shaking my head as I say it. Ooze. Just, 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 why? And the rock, for no reason. Pointless, uh... Oh, jeep! Oh! Oh! They were trying to cook. They were trying to cook Chaz. That's, that's not nice. Attack, attack, attack. What does death spell do? No, mind blast, attack. Fire breath, fire breath. Poison mist. He's down. Fire breath. Shot. He's dead. Didn't seem to do anything. Right, will we can guess what death spell does. We know what corrosion does. Shadow? Genesee Claw? Thank you. That lowers some stash. I think it said dexterity or defense. 
Weird. Oh, she's poisoned. Uh, she is anti. No, Chaz knows anti. Actually, I just realized that Chaz is the only one here who knows anti. Hmm. That's an interesting observation. Uh, nothing here. So again, another irrelevant side portion. Attack, 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 attack. Chaz is paralyzed, so he can't attack, but he'll recover just from a bit of walking, so there's no real important reason to actually, you know. See, he's he's back walking. He's recovered. Oh, little side bit after the stairs. Those normally lead to somewhere good. All right. He's asleep. That's always nice. Padoosh, skadoosh. Skadoosh, skadoosh. Hadoop, badoosh. Rune is the only person on this team who cannot KO on his own one of the enemies. With a physical attack, mind. Oh, hang on, two steps and that one's central. Go up the side step. Go up the st step to the side. That's normally got the bonus. Eh. Badoosh. Ugh. All these flame newts. Mm. Well, at least we have up to five people on our team again. This Seth guy is going to be useful, hopefully. Uh. Oh, wow. Yep. False alarm. False alarm. Anyway. Ah, kill them. Boosh. Boosh. Actually, everything is here is so weak, we probably could get away with using the Pulse Vulcan. Uh, random room with a downstairs. Which leads to a trimage. Y yay Why? Why on earth would we need a trimage? This late in the game. It's star and soul dues from here on in. Actually, there is a shop on Desilus where you can buy the perfumes. And by the perfumes, I mean the moon dew, the star dew, and the soul dew. Uh, moon dew is the one that revives you, but the star and soul dew... I think they're like healing items. Just the soul is more powerful than the star or something. And I know right now I'm going just the completely wrong way. So, eh, 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 victory! Back up, back. Cell split. Frack. Oh, these. This is the boss we faced a while ago. Let's see how long it takes us to KO him now. Fission. Who thought that was a good idea? Of this hive mind of four junior oozes, who thought splitting up into the monumentally more weak forms would help in the fight? Just, that makes no sense at all in any language or anything. Just makes no sense at all in shriekers. Boosh. Boosh. Boosh, boosh. Boosh! Rune is almost dead, I just noticed. Um, which is never good, because he's supposed to survive. Because he's Lutz, and we kind of are obligated to keep him around, even though he himself picked Chaz to save the world. Um... Still have to bring along the guy who's supposed to be one saving the world, even though we have someone else saving the world, you know? Um, well, no, Lutz is supposed to save Desilus. Matavia's our problem. And by extension, the Algo solar system as a whole. All we need to do is find Rykros and we can save the world. Hopefully. It's not going to get much more complicated than that, is it? 
I mean, sure, the only way they can make this series more complicated is if they make an MMO. Oh, wait, they have. Twice. And a game that claims to be a prequel to the first game that is actually seemingly completely unrelated, uh, due to the fact that it's called Fantasy Star Zero, but it seems to be set in an almost cowboyish realm, as far as I remember from the reviews. Um, side stairs up, spread out, attack. I'm really hoping for the Genesee Claw to actually do work. Fishing into some junior oozes. Why? Why? Why fishing? Die. Stupid. Oozes. The fract ooze is so much more difficult. Just run, okay? It's a soul do. So I will get rid. can't even use the repair kit, and probably not the best thing to use. So we're going to use the Trimace on Rune! Okay, and Seth has taken very little damage. I don't believe I've even healed him all this time we've been in the place. Which is an interesting thought. Um, probably should use Chaz for healing in case there's a boss, because Chaz pretty much only uses his skills in the fights, unless he's using Rever. And I don't think many of my guys are going to be dying if there is. Uh, Rika leveled up. She's level 44. Just, 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 wow. Wow. I said wow. Um, Shriekers, just, yeah, attack. I'm just like, I'm just like spamming the key with like my, oh, ring finger. That, that hurt a little. Um, eh. Uh, so anyway, fi flare newts. Flare newts. Oh no. There's a bunch of flare newts. What are we gonna do? I'm scared. This Seth guy takes so many hits, it's ridiculous. I like him, he's gonna be valuable to the team. Attack, 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 attack. Attack to Titan! Attack to Titan! Victory! Ooh, yeah! Oh my, you guys are so strong. You must have felled many a monster by now. Huh? Well, not really. <laughs> I'm embarrassed. Seth, what are you trying to do? Attack, 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 attack. Oh, wow. I, I was complimenting Seth, and then he just turns into a, like a complete suck-up, and... I'm surprised. That was efficient. Totally. Anything this way, treasure. Boondoo! Uh, get rid of the... Elastic gear. Because the elastic armor we can sell for more. Uh, Fractus, Fractus, Fractus. Genesee Claw really should kick in more often when facing Fractus. Otherwise, it's going to, you know, survive longer. It still doesn't survive very long. Um, but still. Uh, okay, I'm just seriously bowled over by the amount of wuss that is present here. Um, okay, so there is one item we are missing still, and it's all the way left, uh, and at the bottom. So it's probably down here. Um, 
Nope. We're still looking for the item. Uh, as I say this, the Steam Summer Adventure just started. I'm trying to find something to say. Uh, it's one green team, as it is. Because I'm Irish, obviously they figured that out and just went, shove them on the green team. Even though on my Steam friends list, I'm the only person who has that, um, who's on that team. Oh, it's down here. Uh, so down here, we have a Stardew, so we can get rid of... We have another escape pipe, don't we? Yeah, there's our other escape pipe. Get rid of that. Uh, we're keeping this silver tusk around at this point, I think, for a memento more than anything. Douche, douche. Ugh, Genesee Claw, kick in. Kick in, seriously. I'm really getting annoyed at the Genesee Claw. Uh, all right, now there is like nothing else in this dungeon to get besides the arrow prism, which is, you know, the stairs that I just kind of went to and thought that they were the actual place I was supposed to go. No, no. After most of us just, ugh. Oh. Horrible. Horrible. Horrible, evil things. Rika. Down. Attack, 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 attack. Bush. Bush, bush. Boosh. This is just some extra experience. It's not really going to help at all. But, uh, you know, it's always nice to have a bit more experience. Because we're that little bit closer to a level up every single time. Genesee Claw! Yes! Alright, so the stairs down here should lead to the arrow prism. But that was splendid! I would love to have that kind of strength. This is the result of many hours of training. You can become strong too if you put effort into it. Hmm, training. Interesting. When did you do ever... When did you ever do any training, Chaz? Shh. <laughs> Chaz really wants to be um, impressing Seth. Uh, all right, so I think what I'll do is I'll get the arrow prism next episode because it's been already about 18 minutes. So I'll see you guys next time. This is Mon Retro Gamer signing off from the Soldier's Temple.